We are Test Rigger and welcome to our channel. Test Rigger is an intelligent, generative, AI powered, codeless test automation tool that lets you write test cases in plain English. Like and subscribe this channel to stay updated with more helpful videos. Selenium is one of the traditional web automation frameworks that helps the testing team create and execute tests in a browser environment. While executing the tests, it is common to encounter timeout exceptions. Here, we are going into more detail about Selenium timeout exceptions, how they happen, and how we can prevent them. Different timeouts in Selenium. In Selenium, we encounter different types of timeout-related exceptions while executing the test cases. The common timeout exceptions that we face are Timeout exception. This exception occurs when an operation takes longer time to complete than the implicit or explicit wait time provided. This general timeout error happens when Selenium waits for page loads, element interactions, or other actions to be completed. No such element exception. This exception happens when the Selenium web driver cannot find the specified web element in the mentioned timeout. This timeout indicates that the element is absent in the DOM within the given time limit. It can be either the loading issue or the element may not be present. Element not visible exception. This exception is thrown when the element is present in the DOM but not visible on the web page within the specific time limit. This can occur when we are trying to interact with hidden elements or lazy loading pages. Stale element reference exception. This exception is thrown when the previously allocated and stored element becomes no longer valid or stale due to the changes in the DOM. The main cause may be a page refresh or dynamic content loading. Element not interactable exception. When an element is present in the DOM and is visible but unable to interact, this error is thrown. This can happen when the element is disabled or overlapped by other elements. Root cause analysis for Selenium timeout. There are various reasons why Selenium timeout exceptions occur. The root cause is when the web elements or conditions fail to meet the expected conditions mentioned in the test script within the time limit. Let's go through a few common reasons for triggering these exceptions. Slow loading. Sometimes web pages take a longer time to load. So if the script tries to interact with the element before the page is ready, then the timeout error can occur. Network latency. Network delays or issues in internet connection can cause delays in fetching web elements, leading to timeout exceptions. Ajax and JavaScripts. Modern web applications use asynchronous JavaScript for loading the contents dynamically. If the test scripts are not waiting for the scripts to load, then exceptions will be thrown. Page redirects. A timeout exception is thrown if the page gets redirected and doesn't wait for the redirect to complete and perform any action or search for an element. Unhandled pop-ups or alerts. If the automation script encounters unexpected pop-ups or alerts that are not scripted to handle, then an exception is thrown. Insufficient wait strategies. Using incorrect wait methods like not using fluent waits or explicit waits can lead to exceptions. Are timeout errors slowing down your tests? How often do you encounter them in your scripts? Let us know in the comments. Debugging Selenium timeout errors. Debugging the timeout errors is essential for identifying and resolving the issues in the test automation script. Let's review some debugging methods we can use. Review error messages. Selenium usually provides detailed and informative error messages when a timeout error occurs. By understanding the error messages, we can identify the reason that triggered the timeout. Logging. Implementing detailed logging in the script will help understand the exception's root cause. This can be done by changing the Selenium logs or installing third-party loggers. Using try-catch blocks. Using try-catch blocks, we can handle timeout exceptions gracefully. So, with this method, we can prevent the scripts from failing abruptly and help execute other actions or log the error. Increase timeouts. If the script faces timeouts due to slow loading, we can increase the implicit wait time or configure explicit waits. Debugging statements. We can add print statements at different points in the scripts to track the progress and understand where the failure happened. Validate selectors. It's always good to double check the selectors and ensure we are not using any weak XPath or selector. The selectors should be accurate and unique. Otherwise, it will lead to timeouts. Tips to avoid Selenium timeout errors. Explicit waits. They are mainly used while checking conditions or wait scenarios. Explicit wait is how long the script must wait to meet a particular condition. This is better than implicit wait since the wait can be closed as the element becomes visible or present, reducing timeouts. Retry mechanisms. They perform the same action multiple times if the particular scenario or test case fails. 
This will be helpful when the initial failure is due to any network latency or improper page refresh and reduces a lot of exceptions. Page load strategy. In Selenium, we can set the page load strategy as normal, eager, or none, based on the application's behavior. This will help to control the Selenium weights. Failure handling. Implementing an error handling mechanism will handle the timeout exceptions. The try-catch method we mentioned previously will be the best option. Handling timeout errors efficiently. Selenium is a traditional automation tool that came to market when test automation was evolving. Though initially many companies used that, slowly they started moving out from Selenium. Selenium is considered a popular programming test automation tool, but more than the advantages, there are many disadvantages to using the Selenium framework. Because of all these reasons, there was a technology shift from Selenium to modern and intelligent test automation tools like Test Rigor, which are powered by AI algorithms. Let's see how Test Rigor tackles timeout errors efficiently and quickly. Custom Element Selector Test Rigor doesn't rely on unstable locators like XPath or CSS selectors. It utilizes AI to identify elements. Therefore, you only need to provide the name as it is visible on UI or its position as below. Inbuilt weights. You don't need to set any implicit weight for page loads with test rigor. Its intelligent features manage that automatically for you. It captures whether the page is fully loaded and only then executes the next test step. This approach helps avoid most timeout errors related to page loads easily without letting the test execution stop or fail. Parallel execution. With test rigor, users can execute test scripts concurrently across different browsers or platforms, minimizing timeout errors. You can see how test rigor is different than Selenium by clicking the link in the description. Endnotes. Test automation frameworks are mainly used to ease the job of testing. So, the effort for maintaining the test framework or scripts should be minimal, which is missing in Selenium. Test rigor fills the gap here with its advanced features. It not only eliminates the maintenance effort, but with generative AI, codeless test creation in plain English, test recorder, etc., it also reduces the script creation effort. Everyone in your team can contribute to test creation and execution now, irrespective of their technical expertise. To learn more about Test Rigor, book a demo with one of our team members. We're done with the video. If you like the content, please leave a like and subscribe to our channel for more informative content on artificial intelligence, software testing, and engineering. Your support helps us build more content to help you further. If you have any questions, please let us know in the comment section. We will try to provide the best possible answer and learn with you together. And here is the good news. Test Rigor offers the AI-driven test automation engineer certification for free. Go get your certificate today. Thanks for watching.